Hey guys, Sandy here. Welcome back to my channel. So guys, today is my birthday and I've done a little birthday shopping, so I thought I would share it with you. Now some of these things I ordered beforehand and some of these things I got today on my birthday. So let's uh, get to it and I'll show you what I got. So we swung into Hobby Lobby and got some just plain old black cardstock um, just because I'm out of 12 by 12 black cardstock and I needed some. Got uh, modeling paste. It was on sale for half off. Again, something I'm out of. I needed it. Yeah, I needed it. I also got a smaller silicone brush because I have the larger two inch one and I thought a one and a half inch one would be a nice addition. So I got that. And then um, a new flag for our front banner because the old one is getting a little tattered. And then I went through their sticker, sticker aisle because they had sticker clearance. So I got memories, some bows, these movies ones, some create ones, adventure, some puffy flowers, some American flags. I got two of these silvery kind of curly cues. They're great to tuck underneath the floral clusters. I got glitter pumpkins because they're adorable and I love them. And then glitter cacti. And then some love words. I had to ask my husband what this was because I couldn't, did, had no idea, but he figured it out. It's be mine. So that is what I got today at Hobby Lobby. And then I also... Uh, we also checked out this scrapbooking store that I had never been to, and I got some stuff there. So I got these authentic die cuts. Um, she gave them to me for half off. That was pretty awesome. I got some papers. So this one from Sunflower Market from Cartabella. I love the little KitchenAids on there, and then this beautiful teal on the background. Um, Summer Lovin' from Simple Stories. It has the cut apart sheet, but you know I didn't get it for that. You know I got it for this beautiful paper here. Uh, land that I love, and then the pennants on the other side. So I got Land that I love for um, Alex's Marines album. Again, a paper I got for the B side because while those are pretty, I love this green on green. Uh, Let Freedom Ring, again, the stars going in Alex's military album. Now these orange stars are not for Alex, they're just for me because I love the orange stars. Not a fan of the balloons on this side, but these orange stars are gorgeous. And this is Full Bloom, so this is a new Simple Stories collection. I got this diagonal stripe, um, on the other side are the flowers. And then this, of course, I did not get for the rainbow side. I got for the crosshatch teal side. And then there's this um, kind of plaid-esque. And on the other side is this kind of fun paper with the snails on it. I might use a, just a little bit of this, um, but I did get it for this side. And then on this side, or this paper, this full bloom. Again, cut apart, not for that. I really dig these stripey ones, so got that. This is Summer Farmhouse. This is a 2020. Um, just a floral paper I thought was great. Again, not the cut aparts. And then I got Simple Vintage Coastal. I got two, only two sheets of this um, because I got uh, some paper, not papers, yeah, like six by eight papers and some embellishments for this collection um, to document our Punta Cana trip. Uh, that we just got back from. So I liked the florals and the green on this side and the wood on this side. Not really digging this side of it, but this is totally usable. So that is that. And then I got some oops, embellishments and things as well. So there's older stuff and newer stuff in the store. Um, some of the older stuff, like these thickers. Like these are from... These are from back before American Crafts dated their thickers. Um, but look at the price on them, $3.99. And you know thickers are seven bucks now. So I got two sets of these. They're this pink lined stripe, kind of funky letter. I got the floral bits for Full Bloom. 
lots and lots of flowers. There's And there's very, very few butterflies, so that's awesome. Creative Cafe. Do you guys remember Creative Cafe in the scrapbooking stores? Oh my word, they used to have everything. This is from 2009, um, and I, I couldn't say no. Um, I got some Marines stickers that I had not had yet um, from Reminisce. Then I got the foam, the full bloom foam stickers. And then the summer loving foam stickers. I thought these were beautiful. I love the rainbow thing there. Um, a couple of gemstone packs. And then um, the chipboard stickers from Summer Farmhouse. It's, they're not missing. Um, the heart just fell back here. Ah, I can't get it up. And then um, these happy birthday um, stickers. These are meant for cards. Um, one might go on a card maybe one day, but these are totally usable for various birthday layouts. So that is what I got from the scrapbook store. Um, memories for the making, but it's not memories for the making anymore. Some woman took it over and it's a different name, but something like Geppetto's daughter or something like that. I don't know. I don't remember what it is, but anyway, that is what I got from there. And then had a little scrapbook.com order. Um, I decided to try out the domed blending brushes. I need it another blending brush anyway because somehow mine have disappeared. Um, I have one left and um, so I needed the applicators anyway so I tried out the dome foam. Um, that is not. Here is my scrapbook.com order. Okay so we got Wander. These um, black, white, and gold thickers and one butterfly, but they only had one butterfly on them and everything else is super usable. So I got that. I also got the Maggie Holmes round trip um, ephemera. So I got both ephemera packets. This was something I had pre-ordered for the shop, uh, but never came in. The only thing that came in were some paper pads and some stickers. Um, so I got these uh, for myself. Paper pads and stickers are in the shop though. <laughs> um, I got this Doodle Pop um, castle, cause you know, Disney. And then I got these guys, these little Mickey heads. And then some leaves, chipboards from Kingston Crafts. And then I got some papers. So. This is Maggie Holmes Sweet Story, so obviously an older paper line, but um, not this side. But I love this side, like that's beautiful. Also got another sheet of photo play pack your bags. And not even for this side, even though it has an uh, airplane on it, I got it for this because this yellow is gorgeous. Love this yellow. And then um, this is from P13. So just some leafy paper, and then on the other side, these wreaths. I will probably use it for this side. Um, Undersea Adventures, not for this side, got it for the Hydra. And then another just Hometown Summer, not for this side, surprisingly enough, even though it's very patriotic. I got it because I really like the yellow and white polka dot. So that was my little order from scrapbook.com. And then, I mean, this is this is going to be a serious haul video, you guys. Like, a serious haul video. Then, I placed an order with Brutus Monroe because they were having their 90% off warehouse sale. And, you know, I love me a good sale. I love me Brutus Monroe. And how could I say no to 90% off? You can't, right? Right. Okay. So, I got this paper pack. This is candy coated. It is a Christmas paper pack. It's eight by eight papers. So gingerbread, cookies, 
um, ornament cookies. This obviously it's called candy coated, so it's all very food themed. But super cute papers. Like you could fussy cut out those if you wanted to. You could fussy cut out those. Like you could make borders. There's just really cute things in there. So I got that. I also got I got two of the sweet candy paper pads. One is for a giveaway, so that will go over there. Um, but this is a six by six papers and very heart themed, but totally cute stuff and great colors. So that. Um, I got a stamp and stencil combo. So this is Santa's Journey. And you like, you make, you make the scene. There's the stars, there's the trees. You stamp Santa right there. It's a whole thing. So I got that one. I also got a stencil and die and jolly floral, so poinsettia dies and stencils to match. Um, I got the standalone reindeer cutting die. Um, I got this because Lana is kind of obsessed with reindeer, like that's kind of her Christmas decoration, so I got that. I also got one of these that says you are out of this world. I already have this. This is for a giveaway. Got some sequins. Now these are black and kind of like a burnt orange. I got them for the burnt orange because I love that color and it's not that, like that bright Crayola orange. I got the die to the till death stamp which I own. Um, and was fussy cutting out this bad boy every time I used it, so I decided to get the die to make it easy. I got the watercolor rainbow paper pack. This is a six by six paper pack. And it's just a bunch of um, watercolors and beautiful colors. So there's that. Um, I got the Joy to the World stamp and die. So it's like a sketchy Christmas tree and some ornaments. And it says Joy to the World. And then I got the die to go with it because nobody wants to fussy cut that out. I got the Fabulous Friends uh, stamp and die because nobody wants to fussy cut out those either. Um, let us see. Okay. And then I got tree farm um, which has a moose and this fun tree scene and then the dies for that because nobody wants to fussy cut out a moose and then some Christmas seasonal sentiments merry and bright oh holy night warm wishes may your may your days be merry and bright happy new year merry Christmas joy to the world we wish you a merry Christmas holly jolly so all good things there and then now we're getting into the fun, the fun stuff. Okay, so you guys know I absolutely love Brutus Monroe for their mixed media products. So here we go. Now my chroma mists were getting low, so I had to replenish. So here we go. I got chroma mist in pink, magenta sparkle. So. This one is a pink. This one is magenta sparkle. It has, even though they are both pinks, they're different shades of pink. And one has glimmer and one does not. Um, I got blue violet. Uh, yellow orange. Coral. Which is more peachy. Yellow green, because mine is almost empty. Lilac purple, because I am at the very bottom, very bottom of that one. And turquoise, because I'm using the heck out of my turquoise lately. Now I also got Ornament Gold Chroma Mist, which look at that, look at that gold. I'm hoping it's gonna be a replacement for Heidi Swap Color Shine. So, gonna try that out. Now, I also got some aqua pigments. I got one in black and in brown, uh, two basic colors that I did not have. And then, 
I got a new embossing powder color. Now, I thought I had pre-removed all of this packaging, guys, but I did not. This is this one. So... So this is Gina K Designs embossing powder, which I had no idea, um, with Brutus Monroe, and it's Wisteria Lane. So it's a good, good purper. All right, now on to the fun stuff. I did get a Lunar Paste in Prom Queen from Simon Hurley, but all of my other things are Brutus Monroe. So I got Chroma Glaze in Teal. Also in coral, in yellow, in orange, and in red. Now, chroma glazes are glazes that dry with a sheen. And then, I got some candy coats. So candy coats um, are like a glaze with extra, is what I consider them. They've got like sparkle and glitter and stuff. So candy coat in pink, candy coat in green, in yellow, and in purple. And then look at this gorgeousness. You guys know this is my absolute favorite in the world. Glitter Glaze and Brutus Monroe makes the best. Um, I got two Fallen Snow because they're my absolute favorite. And I'm out. I also got Gun Metal and Emma's Pink and tangerine like we'll get those colors together they're absolutely gorgeous okay and then the final thing i got was a simple stories class kit um so you get the album let's see what all is in here i want to keep this together though because it is a class um that i want to do so you get the album, it's got the, it's a snap binder, it's got pockets and pocket pages in it. You get the decorative brads, um, some die cuts, puffy stickers, uh, the six by eight paper pad, and then a couple of so you get the papers. And then also the sticker sheet. So that's this is a lot of product. Um, the class was live when it first went out. Um, but I already got the links in my email to watch the class and do it along. But you guys know me and how I take a class. I watch the class and then do my own thing. It's just what I like to do. Um, can't be told what to do, people. Can't be told what to do. So that is my birthday. Oh, oh, no, it's not. It's not. I forgot these. Where's the thing? Um, I also joined Ellie's studio. And this is the May thing. So it comes with some die cuts, two sheets of them. And then uh, cards to go with it. They're bright, super fun, and colorful. And then I also placed my Magical Memories order from Ellie Studio this morning because it went live. And holy Moses, guys. Gorgeous stuff. Look at that camera. So, yeah. Happy birthday to me. There it is. Um, my birthday haul. You guys know I don't do haul videos a whole heck of a lot. But um, I always seem to do a little bit more shopping around my birthday. So, there it is. Thanks for watching. Thanks for sharing in my excitement. I will let you know how the gold chromimus works out. Check out your Hobby Lobby. Stuff is on a sick clearance. Um, the warehouse sale for Brutus Monroe is over with, but they are having a Memorial Day sale. Um, so I'll put a link down below for that. And um, yeah, that's all I got, guys. Thanks so much, and I'll see you again real soon.
for another video.